So yeah, I was over here talking to myself the whole time and I wasn't even recording. Uh curse these tired old bones. Shut up! I lost my train of thought. Oh, it's you, eh? Well, we're all counting on so uh, you didn't miss much. Basically, we got the, we got one part of the key stone fragment. I missed. The, I just had a cutscene where the tavern lady was telling us that that the uh, fireman was down. It's, it's basically the same stuff from the last time. I just one thing that I missed last time. Uh, yeah. Anyway, we're supposed to head to, head over to the junk gate. Hi, buddy. Oh, how did it come to this? My life is over, I tell ya. Over! I sense another inane and time-consuming request coming on. Best to just walk away while you still can, lad. Easy, Vice. Hey there, what's going on? Whoa, friend. Whoa is what's going on. So I ended up having to work on me and my honey bun's wedding anniversary, right? And since we couldn't celebrate the occasion together, things got a little, eh, heated. I want to make it right and get back in her good books, but I'm a little in over my head. Think you could help a guy out? It'll take a hell of a present to make up for a missed wedding anniversary. <laughs> I thought the same thing, so I asked my sweet dumpling if there's anything she wants. And she told me I want that thing you promised me back when we were newlyweds. That thing? Exactly! The problem is I can't for the life of me remember what it was. Can you believe I forgot? <sighs> I am just you know what, for the sake of saving time, I'm just gonna... We, we've seen this before, I'm just gonna skip, so all, oh, skip all this. Well, Red, we got married after I remember. We're so cl Well, what? Like, how? Hmm. Flowers? Yeah. Uh, Can you believe she. You know what? Fuck! Should be easy and but I'll probably. How could I say? Oh, thank you, thank you. Okay. So. You know, I bet they sell red jewel. The strange thing store might deal in such articles. Let's go check it out. Ha <laughs> I, I momentarily broke it. Alright, we're gonna get this out of the way and go ahead and get this done out of the way. Because last time I was very stupid and I tried to hold it off until it was time for us to deal with the shade I over say. here. Each time we encounter that bickering couple anew, we are made to endure an even further torrent of meaningless and incessant chatter. Yeah, they love to talk, all right. Remind you of anyone? Grimoire Vice is 100 times that better. You don't see this old tome flitting about starting Donny Brooks and Set Tools now, do you? <laughs> Save real quick before something goes wrong. Hey, so we're looking for a red jewel. Long story, please don't ask. You happen to have one? This is less a jewel and more a simple rock. Osaki to aru laki. Ya saite za dusty. Kichi oite te chitaru. Ne azuru yori. Wait, really? Thanks. Awesome. Free shit. Let's get back. Let's head for back dude's house so we can give him this jewel. I imagine it would be quickest to make for seafront by way of the canal. Uh, 
Huzzah to us for acquiring a red jewel. But is it truly all right to make a present of something we received at no cost? I think it's the thought that counts here. And whose thoughtfulness are we speaking of? Might I remind you the giver of this present is not even here? I'm, he does have a point. You got a red jewel? Oh, this is amazing! Here, come with me to Seafront so we can get ready to give it to her, okay? All right. Oh, the origin story for the chicken at our house. Welcome to Seafront. I'll hurry and get the apples and flowers together. So, what say you just head on over to my place? See you soon. What a journey this has been. Let us make for the couple's home at once. the two of you and we most certainly recall you madam that lover's quarrel you had back then was the stuff of myth and legend oh hey welcome home honey pants hey snookums so remember how i said i was going to make things up to you after that whole uh, wedding anniversary fiasco well, I tried and tried, but I just couldn't remember what I promised to get you all those years ago. But I had these two gents help me out, and we put together a whole bunch of stuff we thought you might like. Huh. Well, I'm glad you put so much thought into it, but these are all wrong. Very wrong. What? Then we went to all that trouble for nothing. Honey, the only thing I wanted was a nice home-cooked meal. Back when we were newlyweds, you promised to make me a big feast of all your tastiest dishes one day. Remember? Huh. Now that you mention it, work has been so crazy lately that I haven't done much cooking at all. I know how hard you've been working your little tushy off for my sake, Muffin. So, here's your punishment. You're making dinner tonight. I'm sorry, how long have you two been married and you haven't cooked for her? Or made like a whole feast for her that you promised? What the... what the fuck? And you two are going to join us. Wait, us? You sure? I'm sure. It's the least we could do after all the trouble this big lug of mine put you through. I'm at a dining table filled with apple-based cuisine, red roses, and a single crimson stone. Illuminated by candlelight. A married couple fills the room with joyous laughter. The scene fills me with an unfamiliar sense of calm. Just a happy family gathered around the table. It feels so very normal. But I never thought I'd feel this way again. So I stuff my face with the great feast before me. Hoping it helps to hide the tears welling in my eyes. So, what did you think of my love muffins cooking? It was all delicious, ma'am. I can't thank you enough. And though it boggles my mind to say it, 
I greatly enjoyed the company and conversation. Sorry again for all the trouble, but I hope this lets you know how grateful I am. I know he can be a handful, but I hope you'll continue being friends with my husband. Oh, and we'd just love to have dinner with you again sometime. Would we ever? Things get pretty boring when it's just the two of us. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I boring you now? Uh-oh. Oh, wait, no, that's not what I meant, obviously. We've been down this road and know where it leads, lad. Flee at once. Right. Yeah, so, uh, we're just gonna go. Thanks for dinner. Where did that in Run! Run, 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 run. I remember what I was saying now, but when I thought I was recording. Uh, basically, like, we now see, like, we're going through the same process as last time. We're just, it's just, we got more context on, for the other side. Basically, neither side here is outwardly m malicious towards each other, except for, like, a couple, couple of, uh, bad apples in the sack. Like that giant shade that Kanye was, Kanye was, uh, fight, that killed Kanye's grandma. And, and, I guess the shade that's to this Kanye. So yeah, like both sides are just trying to protect themselves. Basically. And then, uh, Yeah, that's about it. I, uh, I have more to say, I just, I can't word it right. Damn! Where'd they go? Get him! Don't let him escape! Military Defense Robot, P-33. You are an intruder. You must be eliminated. Error. There is something leaking from your eyes. What is crying? Who is mom? No. 
my green tour is also dead. He perished hundreds of years ago. Eight hundred seventy-four years, ten months, fourteen days, four hours, and forty-three minutes. Forty-four minutes. Capable of being lonely, or missing others, or crying. I will not permit the humans to kill Khalil. Military defense robot P-33 will protect you. P-33 is charged with defending others. P-33 will defend Khalil. Sweet. Now we're about to go fuck up their days. At least next time we come here. Man, there's gotta be tons of machinery here. Yeah, but I don't know how much we can actually use. Oh, wow. Check this out. It looks brand new. Hey, be careful, all right? This place is dangerous. Uh I'll be fine. Oh no. Huh? Look out! Huh? The noise of the intruders caused the structure to fail. They should have proceeded with more caution. One intruder has perished. Damn. The junk heap. Perhaps we should speak to the brothers. They might know something about this. Yahoo! Oh, hey there. It's been a while. You're the little one, aren't you? You've grown up. How fares your brother? brother's been dead for four years. Oh, 
I see. Please forgive the question. It's okay. I need to ask you something. What is it? You heard any rumors about shades around here? Not the little ones. I'm looking for one that's unusually big and powerful. No, I haven't heard about anything like that. But I haven't really been listening. All I want is to destroy robots. Just rip them up. Uh, okay. Never mind then. See you later. Wait! Yes? I recently got my hands on a weapon. A very powerful weapon. I thought you might get some use out of it. Don't we already have this weapon? Shh. These things happen the second time around. <laughs> this sword has seen better days. Yeah, it's pretty beat up. I mean, there's potential, but it's fairly powerless right now. Can you repair it? I can repair anything with the proper materials. If you'll fix it, I'll get the parts. <laughs> I'm so glad I decided not to throw this out. I'm gonna need some memory alloy. Only the real big enemies on the second basement level have them, so watch yourself. Also, here's the passcode to get down there. Use it on the elevator. You got it. <laughs> That's that was hilarious that they acknowledged it. Alright, let's head down to the basement. Come here, Mousy! It's a shame about the older lad. He was but a child. Sounds like you went into a dangerous area for the sake of the business. Let me in, 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 let me in. Let me see real quick. Uh... Yeah, we don't really need to grind for too much. Just uh, head to that big area right there. The elder brother postponed his joy for the sake of his sibling. Do you think he was ever truly happy? Just making his little brother happy would have been enough. That's what being an older brother is like. Hang 
Yeah, how many alloys do I need? Hang on. Oh. Okay, just one. I was hoping the one hit kill everything. Aha! Stupid like a butt! Uh, Kanye? Okay then. Okay, now I swear I I I jumped in time. Okay, it should... There we go. And I just had to blow myself in the f up in the face like three times. Let's get going. Get this titanium alloy over to him. Bye. 
large seagoing vessel that carries freight and passengers over bodies of water. You have taught me much, Kalia. You have helped to expand my vocabulary. You have instructed me in the ways of the outside world. them last time now. Oh, Gideon! Here you go, friend. That's some pretty impressive stuff you found. I'll start upgrading your weapon right away. And since you did me a favor, I won't even charge you for it. Well, actually, this is gonna take a little more time than I thought. No sense in you waiting around. I'll send you a letter once it's ready. That would be great. All right, can I upgrade anything? No sense in you waiting. That would be great. By the way, what can I help you with? Here. Can upgrade this. Upgrade that. Oh, I don't think I actually looked at looked at this one. This one's cool looking. Cool. That's all I can do here. So, come back soon. I'm gonna end it here. Thanks so, thanks so much for. It appears we have some free time on our hands. Oh, I forgot about this. Uh, head for the forest myth. Popola said we might be able to find something in the forest of myth. You will forgive me if I seem less than enthusiastic about such a trip. All right. So thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you next time.